I'm Broly, Duford's gym leader. I've been churned in the rough waves of this part, and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. And here we are, back on Route 104. About to go see Mr. Briny. Man, this song has a good bass line. I hear it really well because I'm wearing nice studio headphones. Studio monitor headphones. I love how he's chasing Pico around in a circle. I just, I just find that hilarious. Oh, interference. And now he's being chased. Switcheroo. Hold well on, lass. Wait up, Pico. Hmm? Your booger. You saved my darling Pico. We owe so much to you. What's that? You want to sail with me? Mm hmm. You have a letter bound for Duford and a package for Slateport, then. Quite the busy life you must lead. But certainly what you're asking is no problem at all. You've come to the right man who sets hell for Duford. Yes, I would like that. Take me for a boat ride. Who forward it is then? Anchors away, Pico, we're setting sail, my darling. Very good. What the fuck? <laughs> Who the fuck just interrupted our boat ride with a phone call and just brought us to a fucking instant stop? That was jarring. Inside that boat, everybody just went... <laughs> like, I probably just got a concussion and hit my head on the window. Who the hell is this? Oh, it's Dad. I came up with a voice for Dad. Oh, Booger? Uh, where are you now? Sounds windy wherever you are. I just heard from Devon's Mr. Stone about your pocket Uh, so I decided to give you a call. Sounds like you're doing fine, so that's fine with me. You take care now. Asshole. to the Pokenav. Don't bother. Don't interrupt my boat ride, Dad. Mr. Briny's taking me for a boat ride. And I don't care if you approve of it or not. Ahoy, we've hit land in Duford. I suppose you're off to deliver that letter to who else it now, Stephen. Yes. Yes, I'm an errand girl. No longer a Pokemon trainer. Now I just do errands. A big wave in fighting. I'll give him a wave. I'll give you a wave, Broly. Hesitant to say I'm getting an itch, but I think he might give me something. He likes what I'm saying. Okay. Well, thanks for that. Thanks for your old rod when I told you I had an itch. Does that seem just a little weird to anybody else? Fishing advice, great. Pull on the rod, great. Time the pulls on your rod. <laughs> uh -huh. Please don't, please don't talk anymore, fishermen, men. Yeah. Okay. Oh, 
I think in the Sapphire, I had to go to a cave to find Steven. I think he was in a cave. It's, he just likes being in caves. No, I don't know. What the fuck are you talking about? No. Denied. I tell you what's in? Uh oh, what are we gonna do? Oh, what are we gonna do? gonna be what's in um, it's gonna be disappointed something find something this will be good Need a noun. Damn it, where are the nouns? Endings? Kinda like disappointed better. I won't waste too much more time on this, I promise. Um... Might go with disappointed better. Like... Being disappointed, but in a better way, you know? know what I'm saying? There's wisdom in that. There's truly wisdom in that. Disappointed better. That's not just a trendy saying, that's philosophy. You're welcome. Fuck yes, disappointed better. You bet, yeah, yeah, you damn well, you damn well right you knew it, yes. You better play along. Yeah, fast channel. Five minutes ago. Fuck fast channel. He gets it. Good. I indoctrinated him. This guy wants to fit. Generally, they go, right? Stop talking about your rod and washrooms. You weird fisherman men. Ned. Tentacle. I always have like uh, I've always kind of liked tentacle, tentacle. We attack. Yes. Uh -oh. Shit. Not good. Come on. Good. Confusion is such, like, 
you know, it's just a roll of the dice what happens with confusion. I've seen absolutely everything happen with it. I've seen it wreck my opponents, I've seen it wreck me, and all the Pokemon games I've played over the years. Might be a Pokemon that I want to catch um, with a rod later, but I'm not sure if Old Rod can catch it. I'm guessing it can just like catch Magikarp. That's the typical case most of the time in most games. Let's put C to stick out. Which I prefer. I have actually fished in both stream and sea in my life. When I was younger, when I went on more fishing trips with my family, I just I used to do that. Again, I think I can take a tentacle. Let me just try nature power here. I wonder what would happen on a beach. Earthquake? Holy shit! I made a fucking earthquake, sadistic, you monster. I didn't expect an earthquake. That's a powerful move. A hundred power. Jeez. Recall it, it's too powerful. We're going to destroy the whole island. If it keeps using its nature power to make earthquakes. Oh, I registered someone. Wonder if I can rematch people later. Or if that's just like a useless feature to talk to them. About petty things that don't matter. There's also the factor of uh, time being frozen in Hoenn right now. At 6.06 p.m. eternally. Because my battery's dried. Dried up. So I don't know if that would impact his, you know, desire to have a rematch with me. The lack of time passing. Hard to tell exactly which things are affected by that. Mostly, not much is affected by it. gym badge. I actually don't think I need it. I actually got by in Sapphire when I played that recently without Flash. Didn't teach it to anything. I just fumbled around in the dark and found my way around and it wasn't that bad. Just took a little more time. 
to find the way. I have strong Pokemon with me, so it shouldn't be a problem. Sableye. This is actually a Pokemon that I considered uh, catching and training in this playthrough. But I decided not to because I had already trained one before. It's one of my favorites. But I always like trying new Pokemon. That's what's going to make this feel more fresh. So the two Pokemon I have right now, never have had before. Never have caught before, ever. Prefer new experiences. As much as possible when I'm playing a Pokemon game. I'm sure I'm finding the way. I must be getting close to some ladder or something. Ladder. Abra! Kinda of cool that there are a few Gen 1 Pokemon sprinkled throughout the game. And Gen 2 for that matter. I should mention one thing though. Make one thing clear. I am only training Generation 3 introduced Pokemon from the Hoenn region in this playthrough. Hoenn native team. No Kanto or Johto Pokemon. At least that's the plan. The plan can be amended if I want, but... That's what I intend right now. Encounter rate's pretty high in here. Away Zubat. I like Zubat actually. Found an Everstone. Okay. Guess that keeps a Pokemon from evolving. Not sure I'm gonna have much use for that. Jeez. We've been through this, Sableye. Go away.
ladder. That wasn't the... I hope that wasn't the ladder that I'd already... Uh, I hope I didn't do just a big circle, is what I'm saying. And went back the way I came. Oh, nope, this is new. Yes, I made my way! Found my way! In the dark. I knew it would work. I was a little afraid the layout may have been, like, more convoluted in Emerald or something, though. Didn't take too long, though. Jeez. This place is infested. You know, I realize this gym is a fighting type gym, and my C Distic, my C Distic is a Nuzleaf, which is a dark type, and that's weak to fighting. So I'm gonna want my flying type to be more handy on this island. It's Steven. Oh, I'll have to have a voice for Steven. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me? Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. I need to thank you. Let me see, I'll give you this TM. It contains my favorite move, Steel Wing! Your Pokémon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you could even become the champion of the Pokémon League one day. That's what I think. I know, since I've gotten to know each other. Uh, since we've gotten to know each other, let's register one another in our Pokenabs. Didn't read that last one. Last line with correct. And that's a noble. Now I've got to hurry along. You weirdo. Why was he in a cave? Why did I have to come and get him in a cave? Why did I have to deliver his letter to him in a cave? Like, does the mailman just deliver all his mail to this cave? Does the mailman go through what I just went through? That entire cave? Every time he has mail? He just lives in this room? I'm Steven. I need to go fight the gym later. Done with my errand. On this island. Done with the first leg of my grunt work. Okay. Just really quick, uh, what would happen if I used Old Red right here? I'm guessing nothing impressive, I'd probably just get... I'd probably just get... Magic art. But let's find out. Let's find out. Yeah, magic art. Low level magic art, too. I'll give it one more shot. I'm not even gonna bother registering with an old rod. Maybe when I get a good run, maybe I'll register that. Come on, what am I? Another magic herb. Yep, I won't waste any more time with this. Just wanted to see. On the off chance. And get something else with an old rod here.
fun thing about me uh, playing a Gen 3 game like this in Hoenn is I've played this generation way less than like the first two. Just way, way less. So it's less familiar. And it still feels a little bit new when I play through one of these games, but especially Emerald, since this is my first time playing it. I don't think I went in these houses. Did bother. Oh, give me a silk scarf. That's kind. Does that boost normal moves? Am I remembering right? It does. That could be useful. I mean, normal moves are common. Lots of Pokemon know normal moves, so if you have any Pokemon that knows a single normal move, holding that, you know, boost some normal moves. Yeah, go with almost all Pokemon. He, he gets it. Normal moves are common. Okay. Let's go fight him. Wait, Brawly. Let's go Brawl Brawly. Champion bound to Booker. That's me. I've already been through a dark cave. This is nothing. Although, what if the layout's different than in Sapphire? Maybe. Not totally full health, but I think it's fine. I have a flying type. I'm gonna fight at least one gym trainer before I heal again. They have like little wave art on the walls. I like that. Pretty sure that's unique to Emerald. Whoa. Such good music in this game. Meditate. I think I can handle a meditate. We can attack it. Has your meditate ever been attacked by a rabid seagull? Uh-oh. Finish it! Well done. Now I'll go heal. I have to rely on Grimgle here. That's right, cry. Well, that's not much of a... Expansion invisibility. You think battling in the dark makes your heart stronger? I think that's pseudoscience. I think you're dumb to believe that. Sh show me the study. Sh show me the evidence. Show me the paper in a peer reviewed journal that says that being in the dark makes your heart stronger. You know. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She's just talking shit. All right, one down. The layout is different, definitely. It's definitely changed. 
Another gym that's changed. Maybe all the gyms have changed. So that's great. I have many surprises waiting. Oh, holy shit, there are two of them. Am I gonna have to fight both one after the other? What? What? Is this a double battle? Is it a double battle? No way! I fell into a double battle trap. That's not good. Because one of my Pokemon uh, is, is weak against fighting moves. I'm sorry for whatever happens, Cedar Stick. Didn't mean for this to happen. I didn't know there was a double battle. I'm more afraid of the matchup. Finish the matchup. What would nature power do here? Must find out. Didn't get to choose a target. Swift. What hits both of them? Awesome. It was too weak though. Oh, those... The fools. They wasted their one turn. Where both of them would be alive. They should have just attacked. You, if we attack the Meditate, you nature power again. Excellent. You don't want to know me. That's fine. Stay lost? How bitter and nasty. What a nasty thing to wish. Another one. Black Belt Christian. I will harass your Makuhita with a raised wingle. That won't do much. That's right, vastly overpowered. Thank you. Thank you for the encouragement. Thank you for not being mean and nasty like that other person. Oh, another guy. Man, there are lots of trainers in here. I like it. I like more trainers to fit. It's a more formidable gym. this version. But they still stand in no chance against my Grimgold. Oh shit, critical hit. There's a little daisy, actually. like the first gym battle, and this one I have to rely on only one of my two Pokemon. I don't really want to uh, risk putting a Seed Stick in at a fighting type gym if I don't have to. Dead end. Wow. I think the gym is bigger now.
Another trainer? Are you serious? So there's there's Broly. Let's fight this last trainer, then go heal, then fight Broly. No, you won't. Another meditate. Not a problem. Really, you're gonna meditate for your one turn? Useless. Meditate on what a loser you are. You wish. You wish you'll become a gym leader. <laughs> Keep dreaming. Keep dreaming, girl who uses a meditate and just has it meditate for one turn and then dies. Yeah, right. She thinks she's gonna be champion. <laughs> All right. Let's go, Brawly. Prepare to meet a mean, mean Wingo. This way, right? Very cool. I like the gym redesign in this version. Alright, I'm just gonna hope level 16 is good enough. I do have a potion or two I can use if things get bad. Time for Brawly. Brawly voice. I'm Brawly, Duford's gym leader! I've been churned in the rough waves of these parts and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanted to challenge me? Let me see what you're made of. Total surfer, dude. All right, he's got three. Oh, he only had two in Sapphire. Make short work of it, please. Mame his matcha. Well done. Took some damage though. Meditate. Does this. Does Meditate actually know any fighting moves? Just wonder if a nudge leaf could handle it. Oh, it's fast. Focus energy. Is that what that was? Oh no, it wasn't Focus Energy, that was a different move. Don't try that, whatever it is, like Focus Punch or whatever. Don't try that. I see through that. I'm on the attack, all the time. Endless Wingle Assault. Good. No attack. Makuhita. Last one. Level 19. I didn't know it was level 19. That's kind of a high level. Then again, Misty was the second gym leader in Gen 1, and she had like a level 21 star me. I guess I should have expected this.
woke up. I don't know what's gonna happen. What? What? Holy shit. Holy shit. That berry restored a lot of health. You know, I wonder if a water gun might actually do more damage, just because it's probably got weaker special defense. I wonder if Cedista could finish it off if... If Grimgold doesn't. This is really tense. See, a potion might be useless because... It just brought my HP to 5. If I heal only 20 HP, it might just knock me out. Hang on. Let me just look at my stats really quick. 18 attack, 25 special attack. I'm gonna just try a water gun. I know it's not the best type thing to do, technically, but I think it might be better. I was wrong. I was wrong! This is bad. This is very bad. This is very, very bad. This would do swift. I think I'm just dead. All I can do is bullet seed and hope it gets like critical hit on every hit and hits five times. You know. I don't think I have a chance. Oof. Oof. Not pretty. I'm dead. Oh my gosh. I'm dead. Well, I just lost half my money again, and I really hoped to avoid that. That's too bad. Wow. He was stronger than I expected. I think... I think I'm gonna have to level up a little bit before I face him again. That's amazing. Second gem and I'm already gonna have to level up a little. Level grand. I feel it would be foolish to try battling him again if I don't, like, at least meet his level with my Wingle. Wow. Hopefully I can redeem myself. Hopefully this doesn't happen too much more. Getting defeated, that's painful. I'd been getting by without any, any leveling up, you know, much. By defeating wild Pokemon up still now, but I guess I look doing that right now. Take too long. Level up once or twice. So, I did learn something at least. I'm gonna on the bright side. I learned that I should uh, just use Wing Attack, I think. I mean, I could try Supersonic for Confusion, but it's got such low accuracy that I'd probably be. Probably be not a good idea. I'd probably just waste turns and uh, get defeated again. Damn it, confusion. Good.
have to train more in the dark cave on Duford Island. At least I assume it's called Duford Island. It's Duford Town. I assume the island's called Duford. Losing is less of a financial loss early in the game than later, since you don't have as much money yet. But it also sucks when you're wanting to save your money for buying expensive TMs at a game corner. I mean, I would like to buy at least one. And the gambling there is just... It's, it's hard for me to win enough coins at the gambling. I typically just have to pay over the cash to get the coins I need for prizes. I actually tried. I tried to play the slots when I played Sapphire recently, and it just didn't work. Like, I got a jackpot once or twice, and then I just, like, cooled off. Like, I couldn't find any rhythm. I was actually able to play the slots in the Rocket Game Corner in the first generation games. Like, earn a lot of money, like, I would just get jackpot after jackpot. I'm not sure why. Damn, Marvel slots are rigged, I tell yous. There's some really good good TMs you can get as prizes too, so it's nice to be rich and be able to just buy them. I'm not sure if the Pokemon down there are any higher level than up here. Probably not. I had hoped not to have to do any level grinding, right? Like, while well, I was recording, at least, but... Can't be avoided right now. I have to do this really quick. And I have to defeat Brawly. I must rematch him as soon as possible. to do this off recording. It won't take that much longer. I might want to check if I can like buy a super potion. Not sure if I can buy super potions yet. That'd be helpful though. I have close to 50 HP on this wind ball. Just gonna get it to level 19. And then hope being evenly matched with that Makuhita will be good enough. Anyway, speaking of other Pokemon games, I need to talk about something. I will say, um, other than the first three generations, I also really like Generation 4 and Generation 5. I played both of those and had a very good time playing them. 
also played black too. I have pearl, platinum. I think I have white and black too. And then in Gen 6, I got Pokemon Y. I played through that. I did find that it had some cool Pokemon designs introduced in that generation, but overall I found the game to be a little more forgettable. I'm not sure why. It didn't appeal to me quite as much. I'm definitely going to play Gen 7 for the very first time sometime soon because I just got just got a copy of that for 3DS. It just takes me years sometimes to get to the newest Pokemon games. I'm always behind. However, I did play Legends Arceus, and I really like that one. That's the newest Pokemon game I've played, and I really, really was impressed by it. I thought it represented a pretty amazing progression of the Pokemon series. It had, some, it had a few things lacking, of course. Like, it would have been nice if the entire game world was more seamlessly connected and you didn't have to load between areas and stuff, such stuff as that, like go into your home village. I mean, it kind of feel all disconnected in a way. But as for roaming the landscapes themselves and interacting with all the wild Pokemon in them, I loved it. I loved the alpha Pokemon. The alpha Pokemon were so cool as an addition. I loved occasionally just coming across a really big, dangerous, wild Pokemon that was like way higher level than any of yours. It made Pokemon in the wild feel more dangerous, I think, than they've ever felt in any other game. It's like the Pokemon actually attack you. They actually attack you as a human. You can't just run away. Well, you can, but you have to literally do it. <laughs> in the game. And they can chase you and attack you as you do so. It's more immersive, more realistic. I like that sort of thing. I'll probably get to the Generation 8 games eventually. Because I've seen a few of the Pokemon designs introduced in that generation, and uh, I kind of like them. kind of like a few of them. Enough that that game is probably going to... Sword or Shield will probably call to me eventually. I'll probably just have to try them out someday. Scarlet and Violet, I don't know. We'll see. Getting close to level 19. Helps pass the time that I talked to myself incessantly while I was doing this. Almost there. Just gonna hope those two level ups make a difference. stat there. 
Let's see what's at the Pokemart. Is there not a Pokemart here? Wait, seriously? Oh my gosh, this backwoods town has no Pokemart. Oh my gosh. If they'd have super potion back in Rustboro. Kinda doubt it. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take out my Mudcap so that if I want to, I can just switch to the Mudcap, have it soak up a hit while I potion my Wingle. I'd get you a punching bag. You're a decoy. While well, I use potions on my other Pokemon, if I need to, in this fight. Okay, that makes me feel better. Abusing one of my other Pokemon for the benefit of the others, that makes me feel better. Let's go. Still nervous. I don't know if I'll. I don't know if I'll pull through. We'll see. All right, Brawly. Gonna save. I haven't saved in a long time. We've already been through this. I don't need to repeat the lines again. Alright. Oh, I didn't heal, did I? No. I'm full health, so no matter. Full health and I have plenty of wing attacks. That's all I need. Very good. No damage on that first one. Unlike the first attempt. Almost took it out, and it looks like I will. I wonder if he has any potions he would use on this thing. That's right, use it up. Oh, he has a super potion. Use it up on your weak meditate. That's exactly what I want. Would have been pissed if you used it on the other one. No damage yet to me. This is good. All right, let's keep it going. We go. We can attack all the way. That was nice. I'm gonna bet that I would be able to withstand one attack with full HP and do more wing attacks. Although its defense is higher now, so that's a problem. Watch how much damage this does. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. I like need to heal 20 HP of the Swingle. So I'm gonna sacrifice Mudskiff, I think. Should I do this? If I switch to Mudskiff, it's probably going to die, and then I'll switch to Seedistic, and I'll use a potion and Seedistic will die. Uh, I don't know if I should do that yet. I'm going to... He couldn't do anything worse than a Vital Throw, could he? Surely not. I don't want my Wingle to die. If that happens, I'm in trouble. No, 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 not reversal. Shit! 
That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. This is bad, this is over. It's over again. I'm done. Yet another super potion. I don't believe this. I'm being demolished. It's over. I don't think I have any chance now. The same situation. Obliterated. I've never been so embarrassed in a Pokemon game. Obliterated two times in a row. Wow. Wow, that hurts. That hurts. Well... Writing's on the wall. I'm not strong enough. If I fight him again, he's gonna just use super potions and I'm gonna just die. I'm losing all of my money. That's sad. But that's how it goes. Pokemon is cruel. I didn't say this was gonna be easy. Nobody said this was gonna be easy. So now what's gonna have to happen is... I can't level grind anymore on recording because that'll be way too boring for everybody to watch. So I'm gonna have to go do that off, off recording. And I'll come back whenever I'm strong enough to challenge probably again. That's how it goes. I'll come back though. And I will have vengeance. Till then.